How's it going guys? This is Ibanez and it must be pretty weird for you to see me on this channel again because I think it's been about a month since I uploaded here last and uh, I've just been really busy lately, you know, my own channel, life, school, work, it's kind of hard to keep up with all of it but luckily I've got all the guys here that upload, um, you know, all the time and that's keeping me up pretty much. And, um, that's pretty much about it. Anyways, I got a Yu Yu match here against a guy named Ethan Hayes. Met him on the Smogon ladder, and it turned out to be a really good match. So I figured, you know what? I really need to, you know, pay my dues over here. So let's do the battle. So, anyways, uh, I'm going to lead off with my Rhyperior, and I didn't want to get burned or something like that. So I just go into my Frostlass as he tricks me. And now I have a Choice Scar Frostlass, so I'm actually just going to choose to go for Spikes and just set up two layers of Spikes as Shadow Ball's a two-hit KO. So, you know, I'll just set up two layers of Spikes and pretty much just Death Fodder my Frostlass, which I kind of didn't really want to do, but because, you know, Frostlass is gone in three turns. But now I can just send in my Darmanitan, and I go for the U-turn, and he stays in. And that kind of sucks. So now I go into my Shaman, and he goes for the trick. So now I've got a leftover Shaman, and that's just really stupid. So now he's going to switch out, he's going to bring in Yuxi, and I go for the Seed Flare, and it does a decent amount, but because I don't have the Life Orb, it, eh, it doesn't do too much. So I'm going to switch back out into my Darmanitan, predicting the Stealth Rocks, just so I don't have to switch it in later. And this time I'm going to go for the, do I go for the U-turn again? Yes, okay, I go for the U-turn again, and I get a crit on his Kingdra, which is unfortunate, but it doesn't really matter that much, because I can just bring in my Zapdos and uh, pretty much revenge kill with the hidden power. Um, I could have gone for T-Bolt, but just in case he decided to switch out, I didn't really want to you know, have to deal with that. So now I'm going to switch out and bring in my Machamp as he brings in his Snorlax, and he's going to go for the Body Slam, and that does way too much. Oh my gosh. I was thinking this thing was like Bandit or something like that. That really did way too much. So now I go for the Toxic, predicting his switch, because there's no way he would stay in with Snorlax. And he's just going to go for the Thunderbolt and take me out, and that crit definitely did not matter. So now I'm going to be able to send in my um, oh, Darmanitan, and this time I'm just going to go straight for the Flare Blitz because, you know, U-Turn definitely won't take him out, and I'm tired of this road I'm trolling my entire team. So now he's going to bring back in the Snorlax, and I'm going to switch out, and he pursuits me. So, yeah, this is definitely a Banded Snorlax, and that's a little bit weird. So here, I'm just going to go for the, I think I go for the Rock Blast. Okay, yeah, I go for the Rock Blast, and it does like nothing to this Uxie, which definitely tells me that it's physically defensive, and I hit um, three times. But uh, now he's just going to go for the U-turn and switch out to something. He's going to bring in Hitmontop, actually. And I'm going to go for the Rock Blast, and, it, and this is a Choice Banded Rhyperior, so the Rock Blast is actually going to do a decent amount because I actually get a 4-turner, which is kind of nice. So now I'm going to switch on to my Darmanitan to Death Frauder it because this looks like the Technitop since he had the, um, he didn't have, wait, no, he, did, he, did he have Intimidate? I thought he had Intimidate. He didn't have Leftovers though, which is what confused me. So now he brings in Uxie again, I just go for the Seed Flare and I miss, unfortunately, because this would be a 2-hit KO on the Uxie if I didn't miss it. So yeah, that would have definitely o o coded there. So now he's just going to go for the U-turn, and he's going to end up switching out into his Snorlax again. And this Snorlax is a troll, and I need to take out the Snorlax. So now I'm going to go for the Seed Flare, and I get the Special Defense drop, which will be nice. He goes for the Body Slam. It doesn't take me out. He doesn't get the Paralysis. And I can just go for the Earth Power to finish him off, because I didn't want to miss Seed Flare. Because that would have been kind of bad, because the Snorlax is pretty dangerous. He's going to bring back in the Hitmontop, and I know the fake out is coming. Oh, yeah, he does have um, Technician. Okay, and he's going to flinch me, and that's no big deal. And now I know that he's if he just goes for Mach Punch or something, or if I attack him, either way, we're both going to die right here. So the score is going to end up being 2-all, um, and I'm going to go into my Zapdos as he brings in his uh, Yanmega, and that actually works out for me. And I actually go for the Roost here as he's going to go for the Bug Buzz, and that almost takes me out. And I just prayed that I that he didn't have Speed Boost, and he didn't, so I'm able to take him out with the T-Bolt. So if he had the Speed Boost right there, I probably would have lost this battle. But now it's Rhyperior versus Uxie, and he has absolutely no health. All he can do is U-turn on me, and I'm going to be able to go for the Rock Blast and take him out. So that's good game, Ethan Hay. is very enjoyable match. 
Probably one of the better ones I've had in a while. And, um, you know, stuff like that. Kind of feel more inclined to upload more UU since I seem to be doing a lot of OU lately because I really enjoy OU. OU's definitely, um, become one of my favorite tiers. Funnily enough, from the beginning when I used to love RU and I was like, hate non OU, but now I think it's pretty cool. It allows me to. It, you can pull better switch shenanigans and predictions with it. So, anyways, I will see you guys around. Uh, bye.